Hello, welcome in this new video. So today it's a video about pendulums. So this is the second video I do about pendulums because on the first video I asked if you were interested about learning some healing technique with pendulum and a lot of you wrote to me asking me to do that video. So the thing is I cannot do just one video about this because there is not just one way of doing healing with pendulum. There is a lot of different way. So we're gonna start by the basic. We're gonna start by something simple that you can do with a pendulum to start healing. Healing yourself is the first thing you're gonna learn. So I'm gonna show you a technique to to heal yourself, to harmonize your chakra. We're gonna focus on the chakra today how to harmonize your chakra with the pendulum. And so what you need, first of all, you need a pendulum. So I will do a video later on about uh, what to choose for pendulum, what, which pendulum is good for what and those things because it's, it's something important. But um, use what you have. Um, you can even, if you don't have a pendulum, you can even make one yourself. But use what you have and you will see if it works or not. So I'm gonna take mine today. This one is an Egyptian pendulum. And um, I actually have it uh, since, uh, I don't know, one week or something. So. I didn't get the chance to work so much with it yet, but I have many pendulums, so I have done a lot of healing with pendulums before. So the thing is, I'm gonna show you how to do that. So we're gonna harmonize our chakra. So you need to know where are your chakra, okay? And the best is that you, for example, lay on the sofa or on your bed because you're gonna have to put your pendulum above your chakra. Uh, for example, th this is me laying and I'm gonna have my pendulum above the chakra. So when you're above your chakra, you're gonna let, you're gonna have the intention of harmonizing the chakra. You're gonna have the intention of harmonizing the chakra and you're gonna see your pendulum is gonna start moving itself like this and so by just having the intention of harmonizing the chakra the pendulum is gonna sense where is the imbalance in the chakra and so it's gonna start to move in circles and that means that he is harmonizing the energy. So this is very simple. And when he stop, you let himself stop. When he stop itself, it means, or when he move just like he do now, just like this a little bit, it means it's done. And so you can go to the other chakra and you do all the chakras that way. You can also do that to other parts of the body, like I just did on my hand. And you can also do that on a diagram or a drawing, if you're gonna do it at distance. But um, we can do another video about healing at distance with pendulum, another time where I can explain more detail about this. This video is more about uh, you, working with healing yourself and training yourself to use your pendulum to heal. So this is really simple, as I said, you just put your pendulum above your chakra and with the intention of harmonizing the chakra and the pendulum is gonna move itself, it's gonna rotate and it's gonna turn and when it stops or when you stop to turn, when you just do this very, very little um, 
uh, movement it means it's finished and you can go to another one so that is very 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 simple way to do uh, something else I want to say before before you do that make sure that your pendulum is cleared purified so you can clear your pendulum depends on uh, which material is made there is a lot of different way to clear pendulums I can do a video about this if you want uh, to show some techniques uh, to, um, I'm just saying quickly now some techniques um, if it's metal, you can have it above a, fl um, above a flame, uh, in incense, uh, in salt. Uh, you can clear it with sound. There is a lot of different way, but it, it needs to be clear before you give a healing. And you clear it also after. Now, if it is an Egyptian pendulum like I have, they don't need to be clear so much because they clear themselves. Because they, it's, they are Egyptian pendulum are special. Um, they are based on sacra, sacred, sacred geometry, and yeah, it, they have a special form. They are made in a special way to do that. So, yeah. I think I said everything about this, so I want to do more video about pendulum, so if you have question about pendulum, don't hesitate, write in the comment, and um, I'm gonna see for more video, more content about pendulum. Have a beautiful day, and Good healing session with your pendulum. Lots of love. Goodbye.